Hey, it's Phoenix here with Joey, who is the owner, co-owner of? The Crux Climbing and Bouldering. Crux, why Crux? The Crux is the word for the hardest point in a route. Oh, I see. Yeah. Oh, that's very fascinating. Uh, we are went through the part of the orientation today to learn more about how to be safe uh, repelling, if you will, down the Sun Life building. Yeah. Um, tell us the steps that we went through. Well, we start out with our ground orientation where you get to meet some of the other repellers, um, the event organizers from the Easter Seals, as well as some of the organizers from Camp Horizon come to meet you, give you a little bit on how the event works. Then we're going to climb up those six flights of stairs, which is awesome. Oh, it certainly is. That's a workout in itself. You only get two on event day, so we're just prepping you for those two. And then once we get up to the roof, we'll go over all the proper fitting of your equipment. So we start with a five-point harness. We're making sure you're stepping into it and it's fitting nice and snug around your waist, above those hip bones, making sure you can move around a little yeah, yeah. bit in it, pulling it up over your shoulders, getting you nice and secure. Then we're going to give you a helmet and some gloves because that device is going to get hot. And then the repel device that we use is called an ID. We're going to make sure you have that as well. It's the moment of truth when you actually Actually, you're all harnessed in we go past the safe zone and then you get us to walk outside into the area where we're about to repel that is a moment I'll tell you personally it's a moment of a uh, little tenseness <laughs> For a lot of people, it's a it's, there's a lot of emotions going on. They're they're not familiar with the equipment. They're not familiar with the ropes, and they're nervous. They're it's high up. We're 80 feet here. Mm -hmm. We're going to be about 400 feet on the building. So it's a fairly realistic experience for what they're going to feel on event day. So people have some nerves. I think there was a few people who went down. Yes, yes. Yeah, Tell me why you love climbing so much, or what's the appeal for climbing? Um. I like the freedom of climbing and the social aspect of the climbing. Like when you got the bouldering wall behind you here, you're not attached to a rope, you're working with partners, you're trying problems together. It's a great way to, to come and feel your body move. Yeah, and let's be honest here too, it is a physical activity. Your arms are sore, your arms have had a workout, your legs and the stretching and the bending, yes? Yeah, and your core, especially your core. You need to keep your body nice and close to the wall. You want to let the bigger muscle groups take most of the, the challenge most of the time. Crux climbing is also an area that um, you have birthday parties. We have birthday parties, we have junior teams, we run school groups, we run corporate parties. So really anyone can get involved in climbing. Anyone? Anyone. Any body size? Yeah, anybody. Any body shape? Any body shape. Really? Yeah, even you. So are there any... <laughs> that was very funny. <laughs> any restrictions? Not really. We use different harness shapes for weight. So if you were a really small person, if you were two or three years old, we would use a similar harness to what we're using for the rappel that mm -hmm. comes up over your over your chest because your center of gravity is different. But we do have sizes that harnesses that are multi-sized. So they go from someone really tiny to someone not so tiny. Well, I'll tell you, I had a lot of fun doing this, and I cannot wait to actually do the rappelling off the building. Uh, Joey, thanks for doing this. You're very welcome. It's our pleasure. More of Go Calgary coming up. Hang on. That was fun. Good. Very good.